Hi, uh, so this video is kind of special for me. I'm putting this here to remain because this video is going to be my final video here in my room and in my home country, Iran. Tomorrow I'm moving abroad and a new chapter in my life is about to begin. So I decided as for my final video here in my room, I would play my favorite video games and I would have to accomplish one task in each and every one of them. So without any further ado, let's see how it goes. So as for the first one, I'm gonna have to play GTA. Come on. I'm gonna have to play a headhunter. The CEO job headhunter. But the catch is that I I'm not allowed to use the Oppressor Mark II or any other weaponized vehicle for that matter. To make it more simplistic, to make it more, you know, realistic. Well, I mean, GTA Online is in no sense realistic. To make it a bit more challenging and fun. So, um... Your average headhunter job... It would have been done, I mean, it would be done with an Oppressor Mark II or, say, um, a Chopper or a Hydra. But here, we're making it a bit more interesting. We're making it a, mo a bit more natural, like back in 2015, back in 2016. Oh, come on. <laughs> Driving in the snow. So, there goes the first car. And you know it's not really that simple, because I'm gonna ta I'm gonna take the driver first. I'm gonna take the driver first. There we go. Run! There we go. Oh come on, come on! What is that glitch? What is the glitch? Okay. Because fighting the um, fighting the NPCs in a headhunter is so unnecessary. The headhunters and uh, the NPCs, the AI in this job is ridiculously strong. Um, anyways, about me moving abroad. Because, as I said, this video is more of a, um, a memorable one rather than gameplay based. Oh, you know, this is just something. This is just a luxury. What's, what's wrong with you, cop? Um, yeah. A new life. A new chapter. A new everything. Okay, maybe doing a headhunter in snow with all these cops. Good fuck, fucker. Was not was that a good idea to begin with? Or, but hey, we're doing this for not for the gameplay aspect of it. Wait, what was that? Oh, not the cops. Oh, come on. How did I, did I not get him? Get shit up. Almost. Almost. Okay, you know what? I should aim. I should aim. There we go. <laughs> I'm dead. How did I not look at that guy? And they did not impound my car. You know, um, the last time I did a headhunter like this was, I don't know, it was like a year ago. So this is the thing. When you get used to doing a job like that, when you just, you know, uh, 
do it with the convenience of the Oppressor Mark II, then you're going to have some r ridiculous fails like that. But hey, uh, this is pretty much how it is. This video is not meant to be perfect. This video is not meant to be flawless. I'm kind of just recording this to be here. And so um, this was pretty much the purpose of my channel. I kind of wanted to make, uh, you know, a channel. I kind of wanted to make you know, um, playthroughs of myself, so, like, in, say, um, 10 years, 20 years, 30 years, at any point in the future, I can look back at my own self playing the games that I like, and be like, oh, damn, those were the times. And I'm going to be honest, I do hope that someday uh, in the future, my channel, you know, takes off. I'd be able to monetize it. Oh, come on. Hopefully I can buy a new graphics card so we don't have this, all these render issues. Though my new system, because I just bought a laptop. Come on, what the f***? You know, but I'm just gonna drive, I don't give a shit. Um, you know, so my new system can just do a bit better. This one that I'm using, and you can see with all the glitches and all the things, this one is a GTX 1060, so, you know, nothing really that special. Um, my laptop is a GTX 3050, so hopefully we won't get as much glitches as much oh th things like that hey what's up look here look here there we go so that was the gta online sorry other games so up next I'm going to explore the Vice City. Just explore some parts of it. Just drive through it. Um, Vice City was the first... No, the voice is good. Alright, so... Was the first GTA that I've ever played. It was great. Uh, I mean, especially back in the day. This game was precious. Even now, it is. So yeah, the... Beach, the... Oh, sorry. I get a I get a better car if I find one. You see? We're basically walking down the memory lane. This right here is childhood. <laughs> it's a huge majority of people's childhood i've seen even people who are not really into gaming who are not even gamers or who used to be gamer at some point in their life even they probably have played either gta vice city or gta san andreas back in their childhood ow So, um, yeah. Oh, uh, wait, 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 wait. 
and I'm doing this just because, you know, Vice City is just so small. It's not really huge, it's not really big, it's not enormous. Yeah. We just cruised almost half of Vice City in like this two or in those one or two minutes. And yeah, um, I mean, in my personal opinion, the greatest GTA that was ever made is, you know, obviously GTA V up to this point. But San Andreas and Vice City, these two, oh, I just bumped into a cup. For their own time, and even GTA 3. I mean, all these games for their own time, they were amazing. I mean, they still are. Um, and now that they remastered this... Dude, my car. Why am I even driving this car? Yeah. It screwed up. Uh, Yeah, um... Now that they remastered it, though it was a disaster at the launch, even I made a video about it. But it got better. It improved. Wait, 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 wait. Uh, I want I want to go to the what is the name of that island? All right. We're just going to drive through here. And hopefully things will go smooth and things will get better. The moment I started driving to the airport in real life. Because everything is about to change. Now, obviously, um, I'm not going to explore all all the part, all the parts of this voice CD because that would just make the video unnecessarily long but anyways and yeah this was about it just a cruising voice CD nothing really special because I really couldn't think of any special thing to do in voice CD so I just drove through it and it's going to be pretty much the same with san andreas we're just going to have a cruise through the through los santos in gta san andreas and yep that was it that was gta voice city and let's get to some other games so, um, pretty much the same thing with GTA San Andreas. We're just gonna have a cruise through the streets of Los Santos and have some chat. And here's a funny memory that I've had of playing this game. So, um, back in the day, and, you know, we're talking like 2009, I was in my junior school um i'm gonna just get a car real quick all right uh back in my junior high school and this is back in 2009 so i had you know this guy uh, this friend in school that used to play the game um and i was like um the gamer in the class so, like, pretty much everyone who, you know, played a particular game, especially GTA, they would usually have a chat. You know, we would usually have a chat about, you know, um, the characters, the missions, the, um, the things. Um, so, yeah. A friend of mine um, did that one mission that you have to do in Los Ventures. So, one of the girls that you have to date is a staff of the casino uh, the Caligula casino something like that the one that you have to rob later and you kind of date her just to 
you know, snatch her card. Um, and then, well, you know, you have sex with her. So, um, when you get into her crib, the, the, you know, she has, she, I think she has a weep. She has, you know, some sort of this BDSM stuff. So, like, back in the day, then again, you know, I'm like a, I'm like an 11, 12 years old kid at this point. I have no idea what these things are. I mean, I have seen, seen some stuff like that in Manhunt 2, but, but hey, this is, you know, this is kind of new. This is kind of shocking to me as a kid. So, a friend of mine played the mission and he reached a point where you would have to go to into a sex shop and put on a gimp suit this is something that you have to do in the mission and so my friend god damn bolus so my friend was explaining this to me and he said oh yeah i reached the point where you would have to go into that shop and put on the batman suit <laughs> i'm like dude a batman suit i mean i have seen batman and that is not a batman suit i can tell you he's like no no i'm sure that was a batman suit i'm like okay so i'm kind of, so you know i played that mission again on my like my second playthrough and i see that and I'm, and I'm like dude i'm pretty sure this is not a batman suit and that was a gimp suit and yeah <laughs> the confusion about the gimp suit being a Batman suit as a 12 years old was kind of funny. He was like, oh no bro, I went there, I put on the Batman suit and I went to the girl's home. I'm like, dude, are you sure that's a Batman suit? Oh yeah, bro, positive. I'm like, I'm pretty sure that's not a Batman suit. Yeah, it was kind of funny. And yep so that was about it that was gta san andreas and we're gonna move on to some other games okay so now i'm gonna have to fight a gang in cyberpunk 2077 also a beautiful game with lots of controversies This was pretty short. Alright. Another one. Okay, here we go. Okay, uh... That was too short. So, um... I guess that means we're gonna have to fight another gang. Well, okay. Here's another gang. I mean... Oh, shit. We're doing something... Dude! What, what's going on? What is going on here? Okay, um... What are these guys fighting? Anyways, um... It's okay. This is Cyberpunk. The Night City. The game came with lots of controversies. And I'm not going to sugarcoat it. I myself, as... A person who bought the game right a bit after the launch I saw my fair share of glitches but to be honest oh yeah talk, yeah talk about glitches oh whoa 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 yeah uh, yeah speaking of glitches yeah um, I saw maybe one or two game-breaking glitches and yeah 
I mean, there were some other amounts of beaches. Like, I remember just driving, you know, riding my bike. And then having an accident with this truck. And I glitched into the ground. Or I saw this guy who was just driving in the air without a car. Or I saw this man's, you know, um eyes just gouging out of their places and they're like being airborne like this but yeah i think i love this game i'm gonna be honest i love this i think this game is so cool um besides all the problems with the storyline the glitches all the circumstance circumstances all the things you know what i'm gonna do i'm gonna shoot this fucking slow quick oh come here little shit come here little shit don't give a shit if you're a cop there we go now we're gonna have to run dude before before fixing it Escaping the cops was almost impossible. You almost couldn't get away from the cops. What is this? Okay. And just like that. So yeah, that was Cyberpunk. Let's move to another game. So now we're gonna play some Fallout 4. Um, Fallout is also one of my favorite franchises. Mm. Been playing it since Fallout 3 back in uh, 2009. Uh, yeah. And for this one, for this one, we're just gonna rummage through the glowing sea because I'm level 61 and pretty much but not to brag not to boast level 61 is not really that much compared to many other levels i love the diamond city radio but i'm gonna have to just shut it for this one let me just get into my power armor wait 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 all right let me just open the door uh to make it more natural, I don't know what it is. Usually before I get into my power armor, I put on my vault suit. It looks it looks more natural to go in your power armor with your vault suit. I don't know why. So, uh, yeah. This is going to be just a walk in the glowing sea. I already have my guns, my one, my two, three, four, this is my explosive shotgun, my sledgehammer, my sniper rifle, my handgun, my ghost rifle, but I'm gonna pick up my, where's my, I named this one the purger, why? Because I used this to purge all the thugs all the i'm gonna get the big boy the raiders in the nuka ward so yeah this is not going to be something uh complex something too much we're just gonna go why did i go at the edge i could have just eh, doesn't matter uh, just, I'm gonna find some creatures, shoot them, I'm just gonna find some creatures in the glowing sea. I should probably take a, wait, uh, do I have a, where's my red X? Yeah, I'm just gonna take a red X. And I'm gonna, hey, look at me. Don't have any paint jobs, unfortunately. 
Oh, is that a no? That's some death claw. Thought that's a death claw for a second. Ah, eh, doesn't matter. Hello, someone, anyone. I'm doing a special video. I mean, we're just gonna do this just for just for the fun, fun of it. Very simple, and effective, and practical. I mean, I know this is kind of annoying, um, me having to go to my, to my menu to change, but, you know. Oh! There we go! This is what I'm talking about! Oh, they're fighting each other. Get a Simpack. I got my sim Simpack on my zero. Okay, he went under the ground. Okay, he borrowed. Where are you? Little scorpion. We're playing whack a scorpion here. Albino scorpion. Oh, I'm stuck. I'm stuck. Oh, I'm not stuck. There he goes. Wait, legendary? Why hasn't he mutated yet? Or did he? Did what kind of a legendary enemy are you if you're not gonna mutate? Eh, doesn't matter. No, oh, it really is. I'm looking for a death claw. Hello. Death claws. Any death claws? This is my last day. I'm doing a special video, so if any death claws would like to collab, I would appreciate it. Oh, eh, that's just a scorpion. We already fought scorpions. This looks like a death. Oh, yeah, there it is. There he is. Come here. Quick save just for just to make sure. Hey, just a normal death claw. Just like that. You were supposed to put up a challenge. I'm disappointed. Death claws these days. What is that? What are you? A glowing death claw. Or right, I'm gonna initiate a shot. Oh shit. Come here. Oh shit, my shots are being blocked. As a matter. He's not going to get away. He's not going to get away. There he is. Oh, 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 oh. You know what? I'm going to drop kick right in his face. Hey! Yeah! No, that didn't get him. <laughs> okay, that was it. That was about it. That was the Fallout 4. Let's move to some other games. And here we have the beautiful Fallout New Vegas. So, this is actually very interesting. I Because the last time I played, I stopped at the part where you have to walk the lonesome road. 
Oh shit. There we go. And now... We pretty much... I'm gonna get... I'm gonna get some grenades. I built some explosive on my... on this character. Wait, is he dead? Oh shit, no, he's, he's screwed up. Hey, where was... where was... oh, there he... there he is. Come on, dude. Come on, get shot. Okay, this means... I get the chance to use my melee, Jesus Christ, where's my melee, here, oh, there you go, oh, oh, yeah. okay, a bit tougher than what I expected, die, please, die, <laughs> and I have, like, Zero, not zero. I have little melee put on this character. This is like, you know, a. Oh. Yeah, my luck pick is not really good either. Oh, wait, what was that? Oh, oh, uh, right. Um. What is this? Eh, nothing. So, this is the part where you have to walk the lonesome road. That coincided with me going abroad. Obviously, I won't be able to walk the lonesome road. Oh shit! Eh, this is nothing, that was a flare. Wait, what, what, what if I... Wait a second. Where's the laser? The laser detonator. Yes! That didn't kill the guy. And then again, you know, this is a pretty... Oh shit! There you are, you sneaky little shit! So yeah, the metaphor of walking the lonesome road, as I should also do in real life, I'm moving abroad, and this is the point where I'm gonna have to leave on my own, and there is a death claw there, very nice, very nice. You can go home, courier! So... No! Just like that. Just like that. Okay. That doesn't matter. I'm gonna have to... Alright, so... And this is the point where... We're gonna go for another game. Or should I just stay here and keep fighting and keep trying to fight this this death claw? Wait, wait, give me a sec. No, that was no I should no I was gonna use a self boy. That's right, go after him, go after him, go after him. That means I'm dead, right? He missed. He missed. Okay. You know what? I know. I'm going to use my stimpack, but that's going to be useless. <laughs> okay. That death claw is just too tough. But this doesn't matter. This shouldn't draw us back. So, final attempt. Uh... Yeah, there we go. 
Last attempt in fighting the death claw. Oh, come on. Come on, dude. That was that was very interesting. What what happened? There we go! Eat shit death claw! <laughs> so that was about it. We fought a death claw and walked a bit of the lonesome road. Let's go to another game. And obviously Skyrim everyone's favorite so um my last character got deleted i have another one this is a rather new one and this is more like a mage vampire type of a thing um so the objective here is to fight a dragon i'm supposed to fight and defeat a dragon. I'm level 22, meaning that the dragons that I'm going to face are, I guess, I suppose there are simple dragons. Oh, there we go. Here's one. Wait. Uh, no, I'm gonna get my. Wait, wait. Oh shit, dude. I'm using the torch on my phone to put as the lighting for the video and I'm not seeing my health bar so I'm just I'm gonna have to guess where are you no I'm not opening the chest yet wait dude why did you land there oh he's fighting a giant I'm the one you're you're supposed to be fighting, not the giant, damn it. Oh, this is gonna waste it. I'm gonna have to move to a place with a decent amount of covers. Or I can take care of him. Why? Oh, I missed. He's distracted with the giants. But this. It's kind of a cheating, and I'm aware of that. Ah, fuck! Wasted my potions. Doesn't matter. No, don't mind me. Go back fighting the giant. Oh shit, <laughs> dude! There is an entire fucking zoo going on. What was that? There was a saber cat tiger and there was a mammoth and then we had the dragon. All right, we're going to give it another go. Oh, why am I loading? That was kind of fun. We're going to give it another go. And this time, I'm also going to use my bow. I'm not... Sure if... Oh, hey! Not nice. I have my... Okay, um, I have my restrictions here. I'm not seeing my health bar, so yeah, that's nice. My phone. Oh, <laughs> okay. I want to get the bow. I'm going to have to get the bow. Can this one little... Pilar, help me. With every single breath, he does a decent amount of damage. But what do you want with those poor freaking giants and mammoths? You know what? Okay, uh, no, that's not, it's just a wolf. 
No, I'm going. I'm going to use that to my advantage. I'm going to use that to my advantage. Dude, this is just adding to the whole drama of it. God damn it! Don't move. Ow! 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 Again, what am what what am, what am I doing? What am I doing? What am I doing with my life? Literally with my life. Oh, Magica, that's fine. Why not? Yeah, that's right, don't pay attention here, look the other way. You know what, that's it. I'm gonna get into my vampire lord. And the funny thing is... I don't even remember... I don't even remember <laughs> how how this works. So yeah, I'm gonna. No, why are you crying? You're gonna have to summon a gargoyle, and then who are those people? That's just a random black mage. This is just an average day in Skyrim. Come on, come here. It's okay, Gargoyle. We're gonna get him, we're gonna get him. Dead. Come on, damage, shoot. No, this is time for flying him. Ha! There we go. Hiya! Take it! No, no, he got me. Okay. Um. Okay, Gargoyle. We're gonna wait and see what's he gonna, what's he gonna do. Okay, he's... At this point, this is just like an... Like an all on the dragon type of a thing. No, 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 no. No, not me, not me. Please, please, please not me. Please not me. You already did a number on me. You already did a number. Leave me alone. Come on, man. That's right. That's right, boys. We're getting him. Where is he? What's your gargoyle? Come again. Wait. <laughs> That's right. Kill the dragon. Get him. Look at him go. There we go. Dragon's down. No, Mr. Giant. Your friends. Okay, this is what you want. I'm sorry if it had to come to this. Ow. What was that? You know what? I'm, uh, I'm, I'm just gonna leave. I'm just gonna leave. I mean... I did what I had to. I murdered a dragon. Not technically on my own, I know, but hey. Job done. So yeah, that was about it. Thanks for watching. Dude. Dude. Just for the sake of the old good old days. Hiya! Okay. That was that. And we have a giant com coming this way. Okay, everyone, thank you so much for watching. Uh, we're gonna go move to another game. And last but not the least, Battlefield 4.
certainly much better than the battlefield 2042 yeah um oh shit there's another lav so the objective here is to kill anything between No, that is not an LAV. I got bamboozled. Yeah, I'm not gonna remain on in this thing for long. I'm not really good with, with LAVs actually. Alright, you know what? Screw this, I'm out. So, one problem. Oh shit. Oh damn it! Okay. Oh shit, there, there's a truck. Oh come on. Who was that? <laughs> that doesn't matter. Okay, um. Something that I like. Um. Or something that I, uh. Like about this game. Is what you just saw the explosive there we go aspect of it and that another one come on <laughs> that was close um could have just meleeed him doesn't matter um right in for the fun No, get him, please get him, please get him. Oh, that was an incendiary, but hey. Still counts as a kill. So, we already have four kills, but we're gonna move on because the objective was anything between... Oh. Come on, man. Die. Oh, yeah, he's dead. Um, just a very random grenade there. We're going upstairs. Can we actually crawl into here? Yep. So. Oh, 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 Who was that? Who was that? There we go. Oh. Oh, that was a... Carabine, that's fine. Let's see, um, 5-3. Okay, bonus challenge. We're gonna play for another kill. And that is where you usually get stuck. Where your aim is to just get one more kill. Happens to everyone. Wait. I thought there was an entry point here. No, I'm just tripping. Alright, that was about it. Battlefield 4. Uh, that was about it. Thank you so much for watching. I'm not gonna go 
for longer or this video is gonna be too long well that was about it thank you so much for watching now obviously those weren't all of my favorite video games there are some more but you know i'm kind of short on time here right now i gotta go start packing um call everyone to say goodbye and yeah because this is my final video here in my room in iran i'm moving abroad tomorrow to cyprus northern cyprus to be a specific uh yeah thank you so much for watching and i'll see you on the other side goodbye